Praise the Lord, everyone. Praise the Lord. Amen. I'm sitting here with my grandson, Daniel Calhoun. Amen. We are sitting here having a good time discussing the, the, the Word of God. Amen. So I would like to read a few scriptures of Malachi, starting at the 7th verse, 3 and 7. He said, From the days of your father, you have turned aside from my statue and have not kept them. Other words, the days of our fourth father, many have turned away from God's statue, have not kept them, has not kept the word of God in their heart. But God wants us to return. He said, return to me and I will return to you. And, and all we have to do is repent of our sin and return to God and he will abide within us. He will put his spirit in, back into our hearts and he will clear our mind from all filth. Praise God. So how shall we, we return? By repenting. Lord, I'm sorry. Lord, forgive me for my sin. I know I sinned against thee. I know I have turned my back against you, Lord. But forgive me for my sin. I want to return back. So, that's all you have to do. That's all you have to say. For, ask God to forgive you. And then, the eighth verse said, Will a man rob God? Yet you are robbing me. So many peoples are robbing God. But how is we rob God? We are robbing God through tithes and offerings. Praise God. See, when you rob God of, of, of his substance, of his tithes and offerings, he said you are cursed with a curse. For you are robbing me. The whole nation of you is robbing God. Amen. That's why he said bring the whole tithes, all the tithes into the storehouse so that there may be food in my house. And test me now in this. See, so many people are testing God. Oh, God ain't going to do nothing. He, God love me. God's a loving God. He ain't going to let nothing happen to me. But as a Christian, don't pay your tithes. Don't give your offer. Then you'll see, praise God, how loving that God is. He still loves you, but he's a, he's a God of his word. Praise God. There, there may be food. In my house, when you pay your tithes and give your free will offering, he said, test me in this. See, we don't want to test God. Because God is too powerful for us to test. We don't want him to put nothing on us. That's why so many people being sick, cursed with a curse, going through so many things. Praise God. Because they failed to do what God said do. Praise God. If God said, if I will not open for you the windows of heaven, if you pay your tithes and give you a free will offer, he said, I will not open for you the windows of heaven and pour out for you a blessing until it overflows. I don't want God to withhold no blessing from me. That's why I'm faithful and paying my tithes and giving my free will offering. So many people say, well, I'm not paying tithes to the pastor. I ain't giving the pastor my money. You ain't, if you're a true servant of God, you are not giving it to the, the pastor. You are giving to God. But here's a command that you pay your time. How can the church go on? How can the church be built if you don't give your tithes and offering? And how can the church help the poor and needed and help those that are going through if you don't give your tithes and offering? Praise God. I want my blessing to be overflowed. I want God to put no curse on me for being disobedient hard head. Then he said, then I will rebuke the devils for you. In other words, he will rebuke the devils. Amen. The devil don't have no chance against God. 
The devil don't have no power against God. He will rebuke the devour that come upon you. So that it may not destroy the fruits of the ground. Huh? Destroy the fruits of the ground. No devil in hell can be can destroy the fruit of the ground when you do right about God. Praise God, said the Lord of hosts. And all nations will call you blessed. Huh? The nation will call you blessed because God is keeping you. He got his hands on you because you are doing what's right. You are being obedient, substitute the will of God. Praise God. For you shall be a delightful land, said the Lord of hosts. So if I was you, I'd become obedient and subject to the will of God. Malachi said, Bring the whole tithe. God is speaking through Malachi. The whole tithe into the storehouse that there may be meat in my house. Praise God. Amen. So now, let's not be disobedient. Let's not be hard-headed. Amen. Because we want the Lord to bless us. We want to stay in the trend of God's blessing. So let's do what's right. Live the life that God has called you to be. Don't be a hypocrite in the church. Playing church. In and out of church. Praise God. Amen. Amen. So be real. Be real. Be a, a good servant of the Lord. Praise God. And, and pray and seek God with your whole heart, soul, and mind. Praise God. Because God loves you. He loves you with an everlasting love. Amen. And so that's why so much destruction is all through the land. The devil is busy conquering. Praise God. Amen. In the church house. Pray God destroying the church. Running the peoples out the church. So many things is going on. Amen. Stay in the, in the will of God for God can continue to bless you. Praise God. Don't let the devil come in and destroy you. God is, 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 is a loving God. Amen. And he loves you so very much. That's why he gave his life for you. He died for us that we might have a right to the tree of life. Praise God. Amen. So we got to pray and seek God. Pray for our children. Pray for our loved ones. Amen. Amen. The devil is destroying our young folks. Amen. And let's keep them in church. Encourage them. Put the word of God in them. Amen. That God may keep them. Praise God. In the time of destruction. Praise God. Amen. God will keep you in a time of need. Praise God. So I hope that these words have been encouraging to you. Because God, that's what the, the word of God is for us, for the church folks, to keep us encouraged, keep us in the church, praise God. Amen. He said, before, before the devil have many souls, and for, and have many souls, he can't have many souls because, because God said he would turn rocks into souls. But I'm glad that God spared my life. I'm glad that he gave me an opportunity and a chance to live for him, to spread the gospel for him. Praise God. Because I don't want, I don't want God, amen, to destroy me. Praise God. He said he'll turn rocks into souls. And I'm one of them rocks today that he have turned into souls. Praise God. And I hope you be encouraged. And and pray and seek God. Amen. And God will bless you if you do exactly what he tell you to do. Praise God. All right. You know what I mean? Uh, she's here until tomorrow. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have her kicking out some more messages. Uh, I think this would be a good way to at least steer the channel for the next couple hours. <laughs> uh, get off what I'll be on. You know what I'm saying? But, um... Thanks all for y'all time. Um, please uh, put some comments, put some likes, put some shares. I'm going to put her link on Facebook. Add her on Facebook. I'm going to get her a YouTube channel. Actually, my sister channel that I was building, it's 
It's actually going to be the Hour of Deliverance Ministry. You know what I'm saying? Look at God. You feel me? So, uh, yeah. Uh, make sure you subscribe when I get this new channel out. Um, she has years of ministry. Uh, her and my grandfather, man, they have walls of VH tapes full of messages. And what I'm going to do is just put it out here for you guys to view. I might be in some of them <laughs> as a kid. You know what I'm saying? But it's like... Man, good messages from her. Because, you know, she the preacher around here. You know what I'm talking about? She she doing everything else, but she, this the preacher right here. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, you'll get to see my grandfather. you get to see, really, my foundation. Because everybody has a foundation. And, 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 and I learned one thing. I might do what I do. She definitely got her piece about it. Grandma always going to get up in you. You know what I'm saying? But the thing is, I got that foundation. If anything, I got it. Not just me, all our grandchildren. Even the ones that's, that's out here, they got it. So, you know, um, this is where it comes from. I wouldn't know God. I wouldn't be preaching the light and love and God on my channel. It wouldn't be even possible if it weren't for her. So, and this is where it comes from. Like, you know what I mean? Chip off the old block. So, uh, just stay tuned. I found my partner. That's crazy. I ain't even, I ain't, I ain't even never code with anybody on my channel. This is the first person I get with, huh? That's, that's crazy. It's cool. I'm with it. So, that's it. Y'all have a good time, and um, you'll be hearing from her pretty soon. All right? Peace.